Hey YouTube, I'm here with little Jade and she's dressed for Valentine's Day. She's the only baby that I could find something for. So yeah, she's the only one that got dressed. Although Journey over there, she doesn't have the colors, but her shirt does mention love. So that's what this holiday is about. Um, but she's the one who's like really dressed. And then I, she got this passy clip from Tiny Creations by Kim on Instagram. It came in her little bottle and diaper set. So cute. And then her passy from custompacifiers.com came in as well. And this is Jade's. So it's solid pink with the white handle and it has a princess crown with a little heart in the middle. And it says Princess Jade on it. So that's her passy. So yeah, she has on this um, cute little onesie from Walmart last year, I think. And it says Little Love Bug in white sparkly letters. Then it has two ladybugs and a pink with red hearts. And then it has white hearts for wings. And it's so cute and it's a uh, solid red. And then I put it over these jeans that we've had. And then I put on her little black sandals. She does have stockings underneath. And then I just put on this little newborn size um, cardigan jacket that looks really cute. It's white. And she has her little red headband in. She's so sweet. Mommy's little love bug. She's holding on to her little elephant. But yeah, I just wanted to do the Valentine's Day tag by Weeby Dolls real quick. And I also have a haul, but I probably might come back um, and do the haul with Jay. I mean, with Journey. Because um, most of the stuff is for her. Alright. So. First question is. What is your favorite Valentine's Day treat? And most of the time I like um, anything with caramel in it. So I like the little Godiva or the Ghirardelli squares um, with caramel. I really enjoy so. That has to be my favorite. And then the next question is sweethearts or chocolate covered strawberries? I don't really know um, exactly if she's talking about like the little sweetheart candies um, or just like the hearts full of chocolate. But either way, I'd rather have um, either the sweethearts or the hearts with chocolate candy in it I don't really like chocolate covered strawberries although I have been given those before and uh, people always say they're going to give them to me but I tell them don't do it because I won't eat them um, I'm not really big on strawberries but you know sometimes I will <laughs> eat chocolate covered strawberries um, but that's all I'm going to say about that and number three what was your favorite Valentine's Day memory um I guess my favorite would probably be when I was younger and I would come home from school and my mom would have uh, something out for me like a teddy bear and some flowers and a card and maybe some candy or something like that. I always enjoyed coming home to that because most of the time I didn't expect it. She did it while I was at school. So uh, I have to say that was one of my favorite memories. Uh, number four, what movie would you rather watch on Valentine's Day? Pretty Woman or You've Got Mail? Um, it would have to be Pretty Woman, and I actually watched that yesterday, <laughs> but I think that is a really, really nice movie, although it's kind of goes against a lot of things that I, you know, but I think it's a really good movie, and I like, um, the characters, and I think, um, Richard Gere is really cute. He's also my mom's, like, number one crush. Any movie with Richard Gere in it, uh, is her favorite, and then Julie Roberts, them two together is definitely um, a great match in movies. My favorite movie with them two is Runaway Bride. That's my number one favorite. So actually, if that was a one of them, I would choose that one. But Pretty Woman is next. Um, what would you do on your perfect Valentine's Day date? I don't know. Probably, you know, go out to a nice dinner. Um, and then maybe watch a movie. And just kind of cuddle and chill. I really am not big on too much, but... That's probably, I'm simple, just kind of hang with my significant other, um, just have some us time, but that's about it. 
Um, and then homemade or store-bought gifts. I don't know. I like store-bought gifts, but homemade is like from the heart for real. Anything you get somebody is pretty much from the heart, but um, I think it would be interesting to get homemade gifts too, especially from your children and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, store-bought gifts. Um, number seven of the five love languages, which one do you think is your love language? And it has physical touch, words of affirmation, quality time, acts of service, or gifts. Um, mine would probably be quality time. Um, just because, like, you can combine all of those things into quality time. Um, I really just like the chance to uh, get to spend with somebody and, like, you know, just you and them. And, you know, talking, catching up, whatever you want to do. Um, because, you know, time is short and not everybody gets a lot of time to be with people that they love. So, when you do get that time, it is definitely special. So, I'd have to say uh, quality time. But, of course, I also like physical touch and words of affirmation. <laughs> uh, but she didn't say uh, multiple choice, so we're just going to choose that one, quality time. So, yes, um... Thank you guys um, for subscribing, all my new subscribers. Um, I do appreciate each and every one of you, my old subscribers. Thank you for keep watching. Um, I just really uh, enjoy this hobby more every day. And, you know, it's still a lot to learn. But I just appreciate people being there um, for you while you're learning. Um, so... Yeah, so little Jay just wants to say happy Valentine's Day. And she's giving all the kisses out. Mwah, mwah. And she's hoping everybody had a great day with the ones you love. Um, and yeah, so we're going to end this video here. I will be back with a haul. Um, but yeah, I just want to bring Jade on because she looks so cute in her outfit. So she had to get a little camera time in. But alright guys, thanks so much for watching, and I will talk to you all soon. Bye guys.